What up, YouTube? DJ 2020 in the game. I'm just here to explain uh, who is the DJ 2020 and what my channel is about. I'm just I'm I'm just your typical average dude. I've been in the game for like 30 years. I do what I gotta do. You know what I'm saying? I've had record deals like five or six of those. I make beats. I mean, you see my equipment. I got my accomplishments chilling on the side. Um, and these are things I do. I'm a, I'm a DJ. I got my DJ set. I'm also into photography and videography. What I'm doing, I'm trying to um, build a network. I'm trying to build a show. I mean, it's kind of late when I come in the game because a lot of the teens got this sold up. But I don't never believe that you you you're too old to as I say set it off you know what I'm saying I've done a lot you know like I said I've had like five or six record deals big up to G Street big up to Island Records I mean I came out on that like that was worldwide for me to come out on G Street and Island Records because that was the first real like borderline major deal it became major when we moved from G Street to the mother label which was Island. That's when we dropped that album, Let Me Explain, but then, you know, the dude I was dealing with, I guess, I'm not gonna say his loyalty wasn't there, but he just didn't want to do it no more. I, I guess the reconcilable differences with the label, he didn't want to deal with that label anymore, so the only way was to just dead the deal, but the problem with him dead in the deal was I was part of the package of the deal. At that time, I was just a DJ, and it wasn't like I really signed the contract. I signed the contract with him, but I signed under him. You know what I mean? Because I was just a DJ. It was Mr. Me and DJ 2020, so I was just a DJ. But I, I grew up loving music. I always loved music. My mother used to have these parties at her house. And I used to always be the DJ. I would come out. You remember the little adapters that, that hold up the 45s? I used to put the records on that. But I would sit there and it's like I was developing a playlist, you know. I would look at all the 45s. I mean, she had like, oh, damn. She had a lot of 45s. You understand what I'm saying? I'm talking about stacks of 45s. Same way I collect records. used to collect records in crates. Now, I deal with the, the digital playlist and all that. The same way, I mean, she had a lot of them, but I used to run through them because it was nothing but adults. And the only reason I did that because I wanted to be part of the party, you know what I'm saying? Because, you know, when adults come over as a youngster, you know, your parents don't want you out there. They smoking, they drinking, whatever they do, they partying like adults. So they didn't want me and my brother out there, you know what I'm saying? So I used to just find an excuse. Cause we used to try to shit. We used to try to come out and clean up and all, and get out of here. You know what I mean? Like so. And I remember them days sitting in the room with just me and my brother, and we listening to music, and we want to be a part of that. So, I'm always as smart as I am. That's who DJ Twenty Twenty is. I'm, I'm smart. I, I'm a highly intelligent, innovative, technical person. I like gadgets. I like to mess with gadgets.